Hey everyone, I go by Cal here. Just making a video to test out a shorter format for Ranger matchup guides. This video covers just the Berserker matchup in the 1.9 patch, but it also assumes that the Ranger player already knows their options considering they're neutral on their offense. In the full matchup video, I'll have the information ready, but feel free to leave any feedback you have for this format. Alright, now moving on to the video. In the Berserker matchup, both sides engage in high risk RPS straight from the round start. Ranger never wants Berserker to get in frenzy state due to the speed buffs, so Ranger plays an aggressive mid-range style. Even though Ranger has full screen buttons, Berserker is still able to activate frenzy state with full screen, which gives him access to 5mm. And if he has white light, he can take his turn for full screen with core cross conversion into frenzy. The most reliable way to beat core cross is to get mid screen and use slide for strong crush. In the mid-range, Berserkers can use 4S to low crush 2A, and 2B to low profile 5M, which has a lot more reward than 4S without conversion. If the Berserker has conversion, then 4S becomes a very scary option as it also leaves the full combo on a ring. On the other hand, Berserker probably has the worst defensive options against Ranger's grenade setups, rendering him completely vulnerable to the gapless guard break if Ranger has enough MP. Berserker can only avoid grenade during pressure with 2S jump cancel or jam explosion. Even on a roll read, grab OK is poor, and grenade punishes everything else. In short, despite Berserker controlling the pace of the neutral and having higher damage on reads, Ranger's corner pressure is completely suffocating, and with enough mana uh, for the gapless guard break can completely put Berserker in a checkmate situation. On a good day, I consider the matchup to be even. On a bad day, I died from 80% because I got hit by a Frenzy 5A. Alright, hey there everyone, uh, thanks for watching the video, and uh, that's a basic overview of how I was planning on doing each character's part in the upcoming video. I know that patch uh, 1.10 or whatever the next patch is coming very soon, hopefully, you know, considering the Spectre trailer is coming out later to uh, today as of the release of this video, but it's a win-win situation for me. If uh, if the patch is later, I have more time to finish the video. If the patch comes out soon, then uh, monkey's paw. I, uh, the video is going to be outdated, but at least I have something out and we get the patch soon. So yeah, if you have any suggestions for how I can improve the this kind of format, just let me know, know in the comments or just send me a DM. And thanks for watching again. See you later.